Hey guys, I'm Julia Pique and welcome to Motorsport Report. Formula One Italian Grand Prix venue Monza is considering a radical plan to remove one of its chicanes, part of a potential 100 million euro revamp to mark the track's centenary in 2022. An initial circuit configuration suggestion is to remove one of the track's three chicanes, most likely the second one. This would open up the second Lesmo, so it returns to being the faster challenger it was before it was modified in 94. As well as tweaks to the layout, there will be a widening of the track, new access roads, a new main grandstand and possible renovation of the old banking. In Formula E, series founder Alejandro Agag will switch from his current role as CEO to become the all-electric championships chairman. The series will appoint a new CEO in the coming months, according to their statement, with Agag continuing in that position until the new person joins Formula E. Agag said it's time to open a new phase in the world's fastest growing motorsport. As chairman, I'll be better placed to help the new CEO and our strong management team to continue growing the sport that I believe is the future of motor racing. Season 5 of the ABB FIA Formula E Championship kicks off this Saturday, racing for the very first time in Saudi Arabia. 11 teams, 22 drivers, they've got the new Gen 2 car, a different race format, new attack mode. There is a lot to look forward to this season, so make sure you stay tuned on motorsport.com and autosport.com for all the latest Formula E headlines. That's it for today's Motorsport Report episode. I'm Julia Piquet and see you next time.